So Oxford Instruments takes its responsibility to develop that next generation of, of scientists, engineers, business people very seriously. And that's not just in offering opportunities to develop individuals, it's also making sure that through all of our businesses, we are developing the tools and products and equipment that that next generation of scientists and engineers can learn on. My name is Vicky Potter. I have a number of roles in the organisation, but I'm the Chief HR Officer and I also run the Services Strategy for Oxford Instruments. So if I think back to my early career, I'm actually an electrical engineer by background and I remember turning up to those first interviews for university places or sponsorships in the day and I remember feeling like a fraud because I hadn't stripped a car engine down. I didn't build bicycles in my free time. So how could I possibly be an engineer? And 30 years in, you look back at, at, at those feelings and think, well, people are probably going through that same experience at the moment in terms of what do I need to be doing to be able to work effectively in that, that quantum space. What I learned in those 30 years was understand what you enjoy doing, understand what you're good at, and get really good at it. Very few of our employees are quantum physicists. There are people who work in marketing, in HR, in finance, in shipping, in logistics, in manufacturing, in engineering design. And those are all skill sets that are used across a broad range of industries. So I think there is a misconception with the sense of quantum and quantum computing there's something intimidating about that, that language, and yet it is not an intimidating place to work. Oxford Instruments' purpose is to create a greener, healthier, better connected, advanced society. And we do that through developing and manufacturing some really clever equipment, products, solutions that we sell to universities, academic institutions, and into the large corporates that are developing new materials and, and, and advancing technology. I feel very strongly that companies like Oxford Instruments have a responsibility to think about the next generation of business people, of scientists, of engineers, of quantum physicists. Our employees are really passionate about going to talk to children in schools around how exciting their roles are and the things that they are doing that are changing the world. And then we work with uh, universities right the way through work experience opportunities, summer work experience opportunities. We work with um, sponsoring PhD programmes, for example, the iCase programme. And we also offer a broad range of apprenticeships from everything from school leavers through to uh, graduate apprenticeships and, and in fact postgraduate opportunities as well. So I take our responsibility very seriously. What advice would I give to somebody coming up through school or university who thinks they might be interested in a career in engineering or quantum computing or, or a high technology environment? Where I would start is talk, talk to people, find out the people that you know, who know someone who knows someone who knows someone and ask them about what their day-to-day -day experience is like. Ask them what it's like to work where they work. I think then it's thinking about yourself, it's thinking about the things that you're good at, the things that you enjoy doing and thinking about how those skills would then translate into that environment that you've just been talking to people about. So Oxford Instruments takes its responsibility to develop that next generation of, of scientists, engineers, business people very seriously. And that's not just in offering opportunities to develop individuals, it's also making sure that through all of our businesses we are developing the tools and products and equipment that that next generation of scientists and engineers can learn on. So for example, our Proteox S product is used by researchers in quantum computing to really develop their skill sets and set them up for careers in, in quantum computing in the future. 